Hello, hello. The monthly monthly Vex 190 upload is here finally. Finally back. You know, mental me mental breaks are happening a little too often, guys. I don't know, man. I don't know. Why just is not it right now? But yeah, I'm playing some buffed Jarvan. I'm going for the for the tank build. Now Jarvan right now is very strong, as I said in the tier list a few days ago. He has a lot of build variety, and I'm gonna showcase the tank one because I know. A lot of you actually prefer playing him as a tank because I coached quite a few people and all of them play like Bruiser Tank Jarvan. I always played Lethality Jarvan, I think it's by far the best, even now. Maybe not Lethality, but I, I don't know, there's so many builds you can go. You can go Triforce first, you can go Yomus to Black Cleaver, into Bruiser. You can go Black Cleaver into Tank, you can go just Sander, you can go like Lethality, you can go Crit, you can do anything on this champ, man. You can do it all. You can do it all. Yeah, it's very good. It is very good, but I don't really like playing tank Jarma that often because you have to rely on your teammates and everyone knows how wide rift teammates are, so... What can I say, man? What can I tell you? But yeah, this one, Agurin personally DM'd me, man. He cooked it up for me. Full full ability haste Jarman. Pretty tanky. I like Frozen Hard on him, actually. I tried it quite a bit. I went for... Because um, you go... Oh, I mean, this game I went Black Cleaver Sunner, so I have a lot of HP, so the... The, the Frozen Heart works pretty well with that because it doesn't give health, you know, it just gives armor. And uh, in your Cataclysm, in your ultimate, in your cage, you can reduce attack speed very easily from the opponents, etc. But yeah, we have Akali, Yasuo, Zerisa, and I was like, okay, we need frontline, I'll just go, I'll just go J4 because there's nothing else to really play. And we will see how we do. We're just going for a full clear, there's not much going on, just like Akali and Cyan fighting a bit, but I don't really care. Jarvan clear is very very quick actually. Look at this 140. 140 full clear is pretty pretty good. And we will just hit level 5 on the crab. We can look for a gank after that. Can just look to farm somebody after. So yeah. Nothing nothing else to really to really say. Let's see. I mean I didn't hit 5 yet because I cleared so fast, but I'll I'll hit 5 any second now. We're just gonna look for the Zoe. The Yasuo going in. He's getting put to sleep, we just wait for Zoe to walk close, so we get a knock up on her, and we just dunk with the ultimate. Easy, easy first blood. But yeah, your ultimate now gives you damage reduction, if you guys haven't read the patch notes, which is pretty crazy. It is pretty crazy, we're just gonna ride, uh, run straight bot here and look for the sign. He's out of mana, but the Amumu is in the area as well, so I guess, I guess we can't go for him. I guess we can't go for the sign, I'll try to like cancel his recall if I can. But that's that's pretty much it. The Amumu though going crazy on the Akali. Okay, my guy, chill out, man. I know he wants to make some friends, but <laughs> this Amumu crazy, man. The flash as well, flash ultimate. Akali didn't expect it, huh? It's fine. I'm just gonna reset. Grab my cleaver. Cleaver not bad this game. I mean, they're pretty low mobility this game. Uh, enemy team. They have like Zoe, um, Soraka who can't escape the cage. I mean. So you can uh, just ult, but you know, her ult won't save her for too long. She just jumps in and out. But yeah, you can also use it on Sion and stuff, and she can't escape either. It's not too bad, not too bad. Only if you sound like you jump out of it. And we have like Yasuo as well, our knockup can work with him. Akali gets the kill on the side. We're just gonna look for the Zoe here. But my, my Yasuo flashed. <laughs> oh my god, Stormy, bro. He is griefing, man. Why did he flash in? He just gave a free flash to Zoe and she flashed out of my ultimate. Oh my god. It's a disaster. The synergy, guys. The synergy is perfect. The synergy is perfect. He couldn't get into the cage, but he should just use his tornado because I'm sure he had it. But he tried to flash tornado and then Zoe picked up his flash and just jumped out. I mean, it's fine, man. It happens. Happens, guys. We have Cleaver in base. I'm gonna try to cover mid because I knew Amumu might be around, but... Looks like he's fine. He is fine. We're just recall. And unfortunately, the gang doesn't work out, but it's fine, man. We grab the cleaver. They are gonna be very tanky with the Cyan and the Mumu. And Jarvan is very good against them because you have cleaver and you have your first ability, which reduces their uh, their physical defense as well, armor shred. So you can you can shred a lot of armor on enemies. So your AD carry, your Yasuo, your whatever can do big damage. They can do big damage. So yeah, it just works great, man. It just works great. I'm gonna look for something on Dragon Lane. Since we have our ultimate back. Don't think we can do a whole lot though. I'm gonna go I'm gonna go mid instead because Dragon Lane is under tower. We can try to farm this Zoe. They also going crazy. I'm just gonna wait for Zoe to step up. I fucked up my combo here. 
I, I fucked up my combo. I don't know why I misclicked flag. I tried to ult and I pressed the flag as well because the, the idea was I ult in, she will flash away and I'll just uh, drag combo after her. But unlucky. Unlucky, man. Few mistakes happening here and there. We find the Soraka trying to get vision on the dragon. Insta Fuka 777. Just gonna flash away. It's fine though. Soraka is out of the fight. I don't know why Soraka is open, by the way. Like, enemy team is so disgusting, but this game, just saying. They have like Zoe Soraka with Tristana and like good front line Amumu side. I know how we win, man. I know how we win, but yeah, I know Amumu is in the area. He's trying to come for the steal. He's gonna go for the flash, but I secure the dragon with the first ability smite. Amumu trying to 1v4 us. He's so tanky, man. It's crazy. Just one item, by the way. He's not dying. But yeah, it's fine. Nice ult by the Yasuo. I'm gonna look for the Soraka because I know she has no flash. She's gonna chase her down with the Zeri. And Soraka is dead as well. Triple kill for the Zeri. Yeah, with, with Jarvan you won't get too much. Okay, I didn't. I don't know why I ulted there. I, I knew Zeri had flash. Like I, we could see it, man. We could see she has flash picked up for so second ability. But it's fine. It's fine. But yeah, as tank Jarvan, you just wanna give kills to your to your teammates. That's why I said I don't really like playing it when I'm playing with random people. Because, uh, well, yeah. <laughs> well, yeah, if, if you try to get them ahead or try to gank them, feed them, they will just troll later on and you're gonna lose the game anyway. But yeah, we want Mercury this boot, this uh, game, Mercury Boots, Magic Resistance, because Zoe, AP, Amumu AP, Cyan does quite a bit of magic damage too, because he's gonna go tank with like Sunfire and whatever. So it's not too bad. Soraka AP, gonna look for the Amumu here. We know he has no flash because he flashed in the dragon pit. We're just gonna run him down slowly. Slowly but surely he's gonna die. He doesn't have ult either because his ult is very low, very long cooldown early on. Yeah, we, we are just just running them down like the Zoe, no flash. I just dunked her with the ultimate. Yasu doing his thing. We look for the sign. Akali going in deep, but the Soraka is there. So I don't think he can do a whole lot. Oh my god, look at this disgusting champion, man. Riot! Oh my god, Akali actually dies to her. Riot, 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 man. Riot, Riot, Riot. How many... We need 10 bans, by the way. We need 10 bans each team at this point, because I have to ban... I have to ban so many champs every game, and it's it's unbearable. If I ban Vladimir, Soraka is open. If I ban Vlad and Soraka, then Lulu is open, or Yumi is open, or like Kha'Zix open, Chain open, I don't know, man. It's just so AIDS. Zoe open. There's too many picks that are just so broken. It is pretty really crazy. I'll just herald mid. The plates are gonna expire shortly. We're just gonna yoink the blue as well while Amumu is busy. Busy on the middle lane. We can try to collapse the sign right after. Or we can try to go mid, but mid is looking like a lost fight, so I'll just go for the sign instead. Nothing else to really do. I'm just gonna ult him. He can't escape. Akali comes in, and the Kali gets the sign. Man, I really need to play a Kali jungle, guys, not gonna lie. But I, I need a boss man donation, just saying. But I, I think it's good. I wanna play it. I really wanna play it. I get assist on the Zoe as well. It's very easy to get assist with Jarvan. If you hit them with the second ability slow or you give your third ability to your teammates to get attack speed, you get assist very, very easily. But yeah, we don't wanna dive this. Someone might have ult and it's Soraka, so it's too risky. It is too risky. We just recall. Going Sunder in this game because of... Um, because of Sion and Amumu. And I will go Meteor as well because I was like, okay, we might need a little bit of, of damage, of magical damage because we are pretty heavy AD. We are pretty heavy AD, they have like both uh, plated steel caps, they're gonna stack armor. So Meteor combined with Jarvan ult, it's very very easy damage. You guys will see later in the video. Yeah, you can go you can go a lot of stuff, you can go Gargoyle as well, you can go like even Zonia, it doesn't matter man. It's broken. It is quite broken. I'm gonna look mid. Just go for the Zoe, man. You know, Soraka was there, but we have we have our priorities, guys. Every video, every video is the same, the same pattern. Maybe that's why that's why I'm on the wanted, wanted list. But we don't talk about that. Our dragon lane getting ran down by the sign. Gonna come with the meteor on the Tristana. Just gonna flank, flank, flank. I see the Amumi is here, so no more flanks actually. Just gonna dash on the sign. Don't really have a lot of damage, even though I have uh, Executioner, the Soraka can kill them so much. I'm just waiting around, just waiting around, and look at this, I'm not taking any damage in the ultimate. In the ultimate, I am pretty much immortal. And yeah, we just play with our teams, we play around cooldowns. We play with our teammates. Amumu gets rooted up, Zoe is here, she's trying to flash for me. 
I go back in for the slow. I don't care, man. I am Chad. I have triumph as well. Healing a lot. Akali going crazy. And that is uh, almost a clean ace. I mean, I, we did ace them, but it's one respawn. Anyway, we just drink the red. Drake is up. We're just gonna take the Drake as well. We are so strong, man. We are so strong at this point. But yeah, that's the that's the thing with Tank Jarvan. Like, if you are not ahead by 10 minutes, the game is lost. <laughs> normally, normally the game is lost. Because it, you don't scale well. And like, the later the game goes, the harder it's gonna be for you to have impact. Because your team probably sucks. If you're not already ahead at 10 minutes. So yeah, I just know what well, I gotta know how to play early game. You wanna you wanna gank a whole lot and be very active. But yeah, we're not doing too bad. We're not doing too bad in gold. I mean we're not even that fed. Tristan has the same gold as me. Like I don't really farm so much. When you play Tar Tank Jarvan, it's like a different playstyle compared to like Lethality, for example. So yeah, I just gotta get used to it. Just gotta get used to it. I see I'm almost smited early. His blue buff, I just woke up and take it. <laughs> Thanks for the leash, bro. Thanks for the leash, we're gonna go on him, Meteor coming down, Meteor strike, he gets the Grom, he tries to stun me, but Mami gets gang banged, and yeah, you see, I don't, like, I just don't take damage, man, I just don't take damage, it is crazy, it is kinda crazy, and I shred tanks pretty easily, like, Abumu is very, has like 200 armor at this point, with third ability as well, blocking damage, and it's not enough. I tried to flag for the Asus, so I get assist, but he just wanted to do them, man. He he is smurfing. Saw me coming back after that uh, after that early, and yeah, we just try to siege. Look at this: two flag, no, one flag, two spears, one one standard. Pretty pretty cool, man. I was watching Agri Jarvan a little bit to warm up, so I already got the mechanics. But yeah, normally sometimes it's buggy, like when you have a lot of haste on Jarvan. Your third ability, if you don't recast third ability, like you put the flag and you drag on your third ability, your third ability will still have this look, see here? It still has the icon, even though the flag will like come out of cooldown first, does it make sense? So if you don't tap third ability two times, you tap third ability and first ability, you won't be able to put two flags down when you have a lot of haste, because the button will have the, the drag instead of the flag. Yeah, maybe, maybe, maybe I'm just talking like random stuff. You guys don't understand, but it is whatever, man. It is whatever. Jarvan Theory class, guys. Professor Breaker is here. Professor 190, whatever. But yeah, we have so much haste, man. That's why I like Frozen Heart in this too, because we have a lot of health already. We're just gonna get some free armor. The attack speed reduction, not too bad. Well, I guess, I what is this? Ult? I mean, whatever. But we don't talk about. We don't talk about that ultimate. But yeah, big root by the Senna here, I just go, oh my god, Tristana cancelled my... Tristana fucked me up, but I still flash for the Zoe, man, you guys know. You guys know we gotta, we gotta kill the, the little, the little ones, for sure. But yeah, the Tristana cancelled my combo there, it was so unlucky, man. I, I had a 3-man knockup, but uh, now with Jarvan combo, there is, uh, there is a window, so you put the flag down, and while you're casting your first ability to drag, there's two parts. There's the part like before the spear hits the flag and there's the part where the spear hits the flag and you get dragged. So the part where your your spear is flying out towards the flag before you get, you get drag, you're immune to CC. So for example, if uh, a listen kicks you while you're throwing the spear towards the flag, you will still catch the flag and you will cancel listen kick and uh, drag towards it. I, it's easier to show with the video, okay man? Whatever, I don't know why I'm even talking about this stuff, but... Just some. I'm a Jarvan fanatic, guys. I, I'm Jarvan, Jarvan the fifth, whatever. Jarvan the third, actually. I'm his father. I'm everyone's father, man. Everyone calls me daddy in this game. What can I do? But yeah, we move on. Tristana melee range against the Jarvan with a big spear. You know those turtles like to get close and personal with me. Amumu is here as well. He he's getting jealous of the Tristana. We just kite around though. I, if Amumu ulted me, maybe I die there. I'm not sure. I'm actually not that tanky because I don't have armor yet. I'm only on like uh, Sunder and Black Lever, but still, look at this. We just dunk, man. I am tanking 32. <laughs> Christ oh my god, Tristana crit me for 32 damage in the cage, guys. She crit me for 32 damage in the cage, in, in my ultimate. Yeah, that seems very fair. I, I barely have any armor, by the way. I barely have any armor. But yeah, we're just gonna go for the for the Baron here, Baron Rush. I can tank it very easily. But the sign is coming in, so we might have to be a bit careful. We have to be a bit careful with this bear. Okay, the smite doesn't come down. Tristana takes the bear. Guys, what is happening? Why are we losing? 
I mean, the video was too short, man. You guys know. We're gonna go back in for the Soraka. We just kill her. Only Sion is left. Our Yasuo destroying him, melting him. I was just done for style points, man. He's stuck in the cage with us. Or am I stuck in the cage with him instead? No one knows. But yeah, we gave them Baron. Because as I said, guys, the game was just too easy, man. We need some content. We were stomping too hard. <laughs> He's being my smite. Unlucky, man. What can I say? I don't know why I didn't smite, by the way. I mean, it was on purpose. Of course, it was on purpose, guys. It's not like I missed it or something. It's not like I missed it. But we are so far ahead. No way we lose this game, right? We're gonna go for the dragon, but it's already gone. Damum was stuck in the pit. Stuck with Tino. Okay, he just <laughs> he just flashed away. It's whatever. It is whatever. Just gonna take blue. We're still so strong, but we will have to wait a bit for their Baron, probably. I'm not sure we can fight them yet, unless we catch someone. I have Frozen Heart. I will get my, my haste up now. Once you have Frozen Heart, you can do two flags. You can start doing two flags. Because it lasts like 6 seconds or 7 seconds. I give them Baron. Need to test build. <laughs> I mean it's true man, it's true. I wanted to see the full build potential. Unfortunately we still don't get there. But we're gonna go for the Tristana. I'm waiting for her to jump away so I ult her. But she's still not using her jump. I guess she doesn't have it man, I don't know. Just gonna ult, go for the Soraka in the back line. I am so damn tanky man. The Jarvan is so damn tanky. Just turn on the sign. And everyone is just dead, man. Everyone is just dead. The Yasu is still popping off. We just aced them. Even with the Baron. It wasn't enough, guys. Unlucky. Even the Baron wasn't enough to stop us. It is what it is. It just is what it is. I'm just gonna siege an end, probably, actually. But yeah, you can see the two flags. And you can you can get even more, even more haste in this build. This is just like a haste rush, you could say. Because you got to haste items. But you don't have to go Sunder second. You don't have to go Black Cleaver. It all depends on, on the game. You got Trinity Force. I saw some people do Trinity into Sterak. There's a lot of variations as I said. You can just try and see what works for yourselves. But yeah, just build based on the game to be honest. That's what I did this one. But yeah, that's the victory man. That is the victory. Quite a stomp. But you guys will, will find out now why I posted this. Better than 100% of Jaravans. That is exactly why I uploaded Man, I missed the good old days when Vex190 uploads were better than 100% every single match, but now we are washed up. Now we are washed up, and look at the damage. We did so much damage for, for the full tank Jarvan build, but yeah, that's gonna be it. Thanks for watching.